I've been surrounded. They're gonna captivate me. Here are um our fishing stuff. You know? It's pretty cool. You know, some things that you should look f look for are this big word here, exclusive. Exclusive. Oh yeah, that's a, that's what it means. Um, I don't know. I didn't see King's Choice on very many of them, but you know, I suppose that means it's something fancy because there's 135 pieces and these are really really salty. And they're made in the United States. You want to look for that too, because you know, I like stuff that's made in the United States. You know, you tend to look for that because <clears throat> you don't got very many things that are made in the United States. You know, if they're made in Japan, they're okay. But you know, if they're made in China, they can be okay. But you know, I I like to look for stuff that's made in the United States or Canada or. You know, Japan. So here are some of our baits. They're um, shaky tail worms. They're shaky worms. This is a shaky worm. Some short shaky worms, like these. They're mating. That's disgusting. Oh, look, they had a baby. <laughs> um, this is just basically a, a thing of fishing stuff that I've never seen before. Well, I'm sure I have, but not recognized it because my perception of colors has changed really a lot since I was a little short person. Um, here's, um, you know, some bobbers, my dad's, this, is, you really want to get a wood or foam bobber like this, this style of bobber is going to last you a while, it's not going to leak like these ones do, these ones tend to sink, like, you know, without you knowing it, it'll just kind of, just kind of sink. Cause it'll leak and it'll fill up with water and you know I don't like that I like to have a bobber that'll stay above the water you know and he, you know here's the uh, characteristics of the bobbers pretty much this one sits higher above the water but you know it sits higher above the water because it's a taller bobber but this is pretty much the characteristics of it you know this one will sit a little bit lower on the water because it's smaller and then this one will sit about right there, you know, because it's a little bit, it's a little heavier than these wood ones. These wood ones are almost weightless, you know, and this one's a little heavier, you know, but it's made out of bendable plastic, and that's, that's something, you know, you want to look for bendable plastic, because that, that'll be able to flex and bend without breaking. And then you want to look for, uh, um, light, very light wood. If you have some light wood, and that won't break very easily because, I mean, it's not bendable, but it's light. See, so you, you know, it's it won't snag on stuff. Just stay like that. And then you know, like this one. This one is pretty much weightless. You know, this thing. I'm surprised it doesn't float. Like. You know, I guess these are, you know, you want to look for wood bobbers, basically. <laughs> I don't know if that was a long description or not, but, yeah, we got some short, short shaky worms, more short shaky worms, hooks, weights, jig heads, hooks, snap sizzles, hooks, more weights, hooks and snap swivels, jig heads, 
spoons and other random junk. Uh, soldering wire. Yeah, yeah, mm -hmm, yeah. And um, in here we have my baits, basically tube jigs, buzz baits. You know that I can put tube jigs on. Saltwater fishing weights, various hooks of various sizes, jig heads, some other jig heads, shaky worms. You know I have a few of those, and then just random junk down here in my bobbers. Or down here, but I really should put them up there. But yeah, yeah, my dad's is pretty much the same. Only he has a bunch of Rapalas. He has Rapala Magnums, Rapala Originals, cheap jigs, and hula poppers. You know, that's right. You know, I have a lot of stuff like that too. But I keep it in a, a different little box, especially for that. Here, are my dad's lines. You know, he's got six pound test, really thin line. I thought it was four pound. He's got four pound tist, and I thought this was two, but it's really skinny too, so you can't really blame me. And then this is a uh, four pound test. I knew this was four pound test because of the, how flimsy it was. And then this is um, ten pound test, and that's ten pound test. You can tell because it's a little thicker, and it's just you know overall a little bit of a beefier line. You know, if you pay attention to it. Some random shaky worms and stuff. Trout dip. It's a uh, corn. Sponge bobbers. Deformed sponge bobbers. <laughs> they melted. Um, itty bitty teensy little deals there. That's a dime. That's my finger. <laughs> See how those are really small. It's like a uh, poppy and bluegill. Um. Exclusive, you know, you like exclusive, you know. <clears throat> you better like exclusive anyway. Some random trout fishing lures, you know, some little bitty tube jigs. I don't know what they call these. I really don't know. All I know is that they work. That's good enough for me. This really long snap swivel. Here's the snap. Then way at the end of this foot and a half long string is a swivel. We got this double dipped kit. 135 pieces. That's a lot of pieces. Some of them are gone though because, you know, you can imagine. I have gotten my hands on this. So, of course there's going to be stuff that's gone already. But, here's one, here's one, you know, they're, they're just about every single color except for plain white. This is the closest to plain, or, this is a, another one, this is a gizzet, gizzet, um, this is a closest to plain white, and, you know, they're really salty. Cow could use this for like a week or two, you know. Cause these are really super salty. This King's Choice, 135 pieces, double dipped. Just, you know, to give you all the colors, I'm just gonna name them off. Green, ready brown, ready green, silvery, shiny brown, bluey, bluey purple, like this weird color, tannish, you know, green, really green shiny blues brown purple evil green like poo poo green <laughs> um, here's a bunch of shaky worms green brown brown where the green should be <laughs> um blue brown greeny brown assorted Things. Um, chompers, 111 piece set. Shaky worm kit, shaking them up. Um, it's got a set of shaky heads. That's what those are. 
Well, these are shaky heads, so yeah. I guess that's you know what I can fit into one video.